In this video, I'll show you how you can create a completely free WordPress website with free WordPress hosting. So to do this, we're going to go ahead and go over to Pantheon.io. Now you can get here by just typing to Google Pantheon, and it should be this one here, Pantheon.io. So once you're on this website, you can go ahead and start for free. That will redirect you to this window where you can create your free account. Now, if you go and scroll down, you can sign up for a free account. So enter in these fields here and then click on sign up. As you can see, two free sandbox sites are available and this method, I can assure you, is 100% free. So once you've signed up, you'll then be on the Pantheon dashboard and here you can go ahead and create your website. So if you go here to create new site, it will then give you the options of what website you want to create. We're gonna go ahead and click on WordPress. That will then load up this dashboard here and now let's create our site. So give your site a name. So I'll call my site knowledge base and you can see here it adds a URL for us. So you can choose a region for your site and wherever most of your traffic is coming from, you want to choose a region closest to that. Then go ahead and click on continue. If you get a site name that already exists, you might have to tweak your name a little bit. I'll try here knowledge base on YouTube, which is going to edit the URL automatically. So now we can go ahead and continue. Now you can see it's deploying WordPress. So we'll just wait a couple seconds for this to load. Okay, so that took maybe two or three minutes. Now you can see it's complete, but we can now click on this button and visit our website. Right, so now we're in the back end of our website. What we can do now is go to visit development site in the top left-hand corner. That should then redirect you over to your WordPress website. So here, choose your language. Then you can enter in these fields here regarding your WordPress site. So I'll call my website knowledge base. My username can be knowledge base. And um, I can keep this password just for the sake of the video. And I'll also add my email here. We can choose if we want to discourage search engines from indexing the website or not. But once we're happy with all of this, we can now install WordPress. Now you can see WordPress has been installed and we can now log in. So make sure we've got the login details correct, then click login. And now we're inside of WordPress. So now let's go ahead and add a theme. So if you go ahead and go to appearance, you can go to themes and you can add any theme here. Okay, so let's add the theme. So if you go to Google and you just type in WordPress themes, uh, you'll be able to choose one of many themes. So go to the actual WordPress website and we can download 5,000 themes here. Now, obviously you can go and filter through these and choose one that you like, but I have a theme in mind and I'm gonna download this bloggers theme. So here we go. We can now click download on this theme and these are all completely free. So now we've got the zip file. Now we can go back to our website. We can click on add new and I can upload this theme. Alternatively, you can skip that step and just uh, choose from 5,000 themes here. Okay, so let's activate this theme and now we can preview our website. So if we go ahead and hover over our, our website name and we can click on visit site and there you go. Now our website is all ready. Now we just need to go and add content so we can add blog posts and blog pages and you've now got a fully working WordPress website.